All right, guys, we got news out of West Virginia, and it's not good news yet again, and it involves another sheriff's department in the state of West Virginia. This man here is Deputy Jeff Racer, Jr. with the Cable County Sheriff's Department here in West Virginia. On December 31st, 2022, Deputy Racer was operating his cruiser at a high rate of speed for no reason. He was not responding to an emergency call. He was not responding code three with lights and siren. He was speeding for absolutely no reason. And in doing so, he blew through an intersection and struck a 13-year-old girl named Laney. Laney was thrown more than half a block down a city street. She subsequently passed away. This is Laney. I want you all to take a look at this. This is the face of somebody who died for absolutely no reason due to a deputy's negligence. And upon reading up on this on Facebook, apparently Deputy Racer has multiple reports and complaints from the community that he speeds excessively for no reason with no lights, no sirens. He turns on his emergency lights just to get through red lights at intersections and then just continues driving with normal traffic. This is not okay. That is called malfeasance. If any normal citizen were to have driven their car at a high rate of speed, blew through an intersection, and struck and killed a 13-year-old girl, sending her flying more than half a block down a city street. They would have been immediately arrested, charged, taken to the police station, given a bail. It would have been a whole ordeal. Not so with Deputy Racer. Deputy Racer was actually escorted from the scene by a fellow deputy allowed to go home. And he is now paid on paid administrative leave pending their own internal investigation by the Sheriff's Department. It's up to you folks. Make the phone calls, share this with everybody you know, and get justice for Laney.